I clawed my way out of Willamette. I fought hard to uncover the truth of what happened at that mall. And things were good. Real good. For a while. Then, I let things get to me. I let things get out of control. I think deep down, I knew I hadn't uncovered what was really going on. got pretty dark, but this is my chance to get back in the game. Excuse me, sir. What is it, kid? I signed your waiver. You got my next of kin. Are the vultures circling already? Yeah, sorry, sir. It's just paperwork. They want it from everyone. Would you mind if I got your autograph? Uh... Sure. Sorry about that, it's just, uh, it's been a while. You've always been a big hero of mine, Mr. West. I was really bummed when your show went off the air. Wow, thanks. So I guess this would be worth quite a bit if anything happened to you out there tonight. Uh, yeah. I guess so. Good luck out there. Maybe this wasn't such a bad idea after all. TK has a very special surprise for you. He is the original zombie killer himself. The one, the only. of all rematches. Now Frank's gotta kill zombies to earn cash. Bigger the death, bigger the payoff. Especially if you use those corner grinders. And I do like a good grinding. <laughs> but first, TK has got a personal message just for you, Frank West. You gotta be willing to risk it all if you're ever really gonna
veterinarians are looking into the problem and have been examining the diets on different farms. This seems to have only compounded the problems which have been linked to the beef shortage in local areas. The zombie rights group Cure is in the news again. The protest group has shown up in the adult playground of Fortune City, which was chosen as the site of the latest installment of the pay-per-view game show, Terror is Reality. The protest just compounds the problems of the game show, which has been plagued recently by tumbling ratings and controversy. Cure was on the site of the show to display their opposition to what they call the unethical treatment of zombies. Stacy Forsythe, the leader of the Nevada branch of Cure, had this to say. Let our government know we will not stand for their systematic neglect of the infected. We must take drastic action now. Public opinion is mixed on the group's views, which are sometimes seen as radical. This is a joke, right? Why would you want to save those things? Stay tuned. Coming up right after the break, we've got weather and sports. I can't believe I just did that. I feel like such a sellout. Hey, do you know how I can get the hell out of here? Yeah, take the elevator up a floor and then straight down the hallway. You can't miss it. something so important it's it's really kind of awesome what the hell are you up to tk remember not a word of this to anyone damn it okay you stay cool all right i gotta get back to my show well 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 looky here frank west Hey, fanboys. You're a little late for the autographs. I was uh, just looking for the men's room. Story of my life. Nah, I think we showed up right in the nick of time. <laughs> You've overstayed your welcome a bit, Frankie. Call me if you're for a photo shoot. Your performance was a little limp tonight, Frank. You must have to take pills for that at your age. Well, good night, ladies.
Um, I can't get a signal. Why? Why can't I get a signal? She, she was, she was looking right at me, and they had her, and I, I couldn't do anything. She went down without a sound, and I, I had to get out of there. I just ran. Frank. Frank West. Oh, you're the big shot from Willamette. Yeah, yeah. I seen you on TV. They don't take this the wrong way. But ain't you infected? Hey, don't worry. It's under control. Oh, yeah? You better have three days worth, pal. Because you seem real nice. And I'd hate to have to put a bullet in your head. Uh, thanks. We ain't got any Zombrex here. Military have to quarantine first. They'll enter the city at first light three days from now to get all of us. That's the standard procedure. So we're stuck here? Better to be stuck in here, not out there, don't you think? you were infected, though I don't remember you saying anything about that in your book. Well, it's not exactly something I'd go around advertising. There's a pharmacy in the Royal Flesh Mall. I'm Stacy Forsyth, by the way. I'm Frank. Frank... Frank West. Plenty of people know you. Do you know a way out of here? No, but if you find one, I suggest you take this. That way we can keep in touch. There's closed circuit cameras all over the city. These monitors are playback only, but I'll keep an eye on them. And Frank, if you find anyone alive out there... Sure. I've got, uh, a little experience rounding up survivors. Keep Frank West bottled up.
lie to me! We don't have a safe! Don't lie hey, to me! Hey, don't you have something better to do? Why don't you mind your own business, old man? Just looking for some meds. No need to get ugly. Well, you're definitely going to need some painkillers when I'm done with you. Well, talking to you is giving me a headache. Oh, yeah? What say you give me some money, and I'll go get some for you? Yeah, give us some money, Grandpa. We'll help you out. How about it, Grandpa? You got any money? Where on earth did you find him? Never mind. I don't want to know. Well, I wasn't just gonna leave him there. We can't afford to have any more infected in here. One's enough. I've been told that we have received a broadcast from our field reporter, Rebecca Chang, who is inside Fortune City. It is clear that the outbreak started in the Fortune City Arena during last night's Terror is Reality show. Information received from a behind-the-scenes source reveals that this outbreak was not an accident, but rather an act of terrorism. Oh, Rebecca. Look at you. Not the weather girl Arena, anymore. The site of the Terror is Reality game show. It may be upsetting to some viewers. Security cameras, lady. What the hell were you thinking? Your group's got a reputation, but come on. Cure had nothing to do with this. It's pretty easy to say that, isn't it? But you're gonna need more than that. You better start talking. Right now. I'm telling you, we're being set up. We've been accused of things before, but we don't believe in violence. We're someone's convenient excuse. Oh, really? It's not the first time members of Cure have been falsely accused of being involved with an outbreak. I've got to find whoever leaked that tape. That damn TK and his horrible show. I'm not saying I believe you, but something's not right here, that's for damn sure. I needed something to get back in the game. I investigate this, and maybe I get back to doing what I do best. That reporter, where is she? She said she was in the hotel. I know this could end up being a big chance for your career. But don't forget, this could mean my life. out here buddy um thanks rebecca chang channel six action news frank west oh i know you you used to be a kind of a hero of mine before you got washed up you homesick for zombies what are you doing here hey i came to help with your story i think cure's being set up 
My exclusive tape says otherwise, and I don't exactly need your help. It doesn't have to be a contest, lady. I help you, you help me. Simple. Where'd you get that tape from, darling? Reporters don't reveal their sources, Frank. Not real ones, anyway. I wouldn't underestimate Frank West, sweetheart. I got some pictures you might be interested in. Okay, let's see what you got. Not so fast. You gotta throw the old dog a bone before he does any tricks. Okay, maybe I'll let you tag along for a while. That's more like it. I can't tell you my source, but there is a central security room. There'll be footage of everything that happened there. I can show you where it is. Well, you show me yours, I show you mine. Where's your crew? Hmm. They ran off with all the equipment. I guess they just didn't want it bad enough. Damn it. I have no idea how you would survive out here on your own. Just push the button, lady. I hope I don't have to do everything for you. Well, what are you waiting for? Just admiring your skills. try. They didn't teach me that in journalism school. You went to journalism school? <laughs> Could have fooled me. What a mess. Well, this just gets better and better. Wow, looks like somebody didn't like the show much. You should get this on video. They didn't want us to see what really went down. Frank, check this out. Zombies don't use guns. I'm not so sure Kira's not involved, but it definitely proves someone's covering up what really happened. Not a bad lead, kiddo. Now it's time to show me those pictures, Frank. Frank, you need to get back to the bunker now. What is it, Stacy? It's Sullivan. He saw the report. Can you get back here? He's threatening to kick me out. I'm on my way. Wait, who is that? Just a friend. The leader of Cure. Gotta go. He can't ditch me for long. You should be ashamed of yourself. You're nothing but a common criminal. You cause nothing but trouble. Cure is innocent. It's a setup. I saw your buddies on TV, lady. I saw your picture. Hey. And a man like you, real American. Helping out trash like this. You don't need that kind of publicity, Bell. Sullivan, I think Cure is being set up. I saw it on the TV with my own eyes. Explain how that little trick works. There's something else going on here, Sullivan. I found some evidence at the arena of a cover-up. I've got a feeling TK, the host of that game show, is involved somehow. I saw him backstage at his show, swapping a briefcase of money with the guy they showed on TV starting this outbreak. Ahem. You could have told me that the front door was locked. Hey, you're that TV lady. I'll make you a deal. You two do your little investigation. You see if you can help this troublemaker. But ain't no one gonna cover her ass when the military arrives. And she ain't allowed off the premises. I'll be guarding the door. 
Don't think I won't do what I have to do. <laughs> what was that all about? He just takes his job too seriously. Tell me you found something. We checked out Central Security. Someone's definitely trying to hide something. Everything was smashed to pieces. This is my, uh, new friend. Stacy, I'm Rebecca Chang, Channel 6 Action News. I'm here to help. Oh. You'll forgive me if I don't think it's very helpful that you accused my organization of a crime we didn't commit. Look, I don't know what's going on here, but clearly things are not as they seem. I put out the information I had at the time. Hey, I love a good catfight, but we're not getting anywhere unless we work together, ladies. Works for me. Whether you're innocent or guilty. I just want the truth. Thanks for the vote of confidence. But okay. We'll work together. I'll keep an eye on these monitors. And I'm going back out there to see what I can find out. I'll let you know if I see anything. Snowflake hungry. Look what I found, you pretty girl. Shit. Fresh meat. <laughs> hey, uh. There are lots of zombies around here. Maybe she could eat those. No! No, not zombies! That mirror's rotten! It's like all her food now! It, it went bad! She needs meat. Fresh meat! Sure, sure. I can get some fresh meat. Steak! Maybe I'll go look for some. No! <laughs> People not been very good to me. Not like Snowflake. Snowflake, my friend. Whoa, listen, let's talk this over, okay? What's your name? Theodore. But everyone call me Ted. Ted, huh? That's a nice name. We just need to slow down and talk this over, Ted. Nice and slow. No! Ted, not slow! They all said that! Ted, not slow! Stop saying that! See, people not nice! Snowflake, go and eat your fresh meat. Nice and slow. Good 
Okay. All right, you and I need to talk. That guy, he's part of your group. He pretty much admitted it to my face, and I saw him take money from TK. That guy, he was new to Cure. We wouldn't do this. But that cutthroat TK might. You have to believe me. I'll tell you what I believe. TK paid him to destroy his own show. But why? Hey, what was that? I don't know. It looks like something's going on at the entrance to this maintenance tunnel. Can't quite tell for sure, but it looks like someone is moving equipment or something. Looks pretty organized. Might be survivors. Might be a lead. I'm gonna find out right now. Listen, Frank. What? Nothing. Just... I know this is a great opportunity for you. But there's a lot more at stake. confused with someone else. You are... You're not the reviewer. But I've been waiting for you! No offense, but I really don't want to eat that. How dare you! I'm Antoine! I am the king of cuisine! No matter. No matter. This can still be a once-in-a-lifetime meal, so sit, relax. Antoine will make you dinner! <laughs>
up to, TK? Just enjoying the land of opportunity, Frankie. You paid Cure to start the outbreak, didn't you? No need to dwell on the details when we all come out ahead. Come out ahead? What the hell? Thousands of people are dead. You're not gonna get away with it. Oh, come off it, Frank. I brought you back in the public eye. Don't I even get a thank you? Good night. As ever. Are you all right? I've been better. What's going on? That bastard TK tried to take me out. He survived the outbreak? Yeah, unfortunately. And it looks like he's up to something. It's not over yet. Frank, you've got to stop that bastard. He killed all those people and he wants us to take the fall. I'm on it. Buddy, I thought you were one of those crazies. I just can't trust people anymore. And I've been dealing with nut bars all day long. These zombies. They're annoying, sure, but they're easy to kill. Well, kinda, kinda fun, even. The real threat is the people. An outbreak like this does things to men. Violence, the death, seeing loved ones die. Change. It makes people snap. Just like that. People just like you and me. Just when humanity should be coming together, they turn on each other instead. I've got a daughter to protect. I won't let anything get in my way. Your daughter? Listen, uh, I can take you both back to the safe house. Katie needs her Zombrex every 24 hours. Right, baby? Oh, your daughter. Do you know what would happen if she didn't get her Zombrex every day? But I would never let that happen. We still have some time, Katie. I'll find some if it kills me. Hey, look. Let's get you and your daughter back to the safe house so that... Get the hell away from her. Ooh, crap. You're just one of those nut bars. You just want to hurt her. Keep her from getting her some crap. Okay. 
You're safe now. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. I can't imagine what I would do if anything ever happened to you. Damn. That guy was a few screws short of a workbench. This place is nuts. What's going on? I'm pretty sure I saw somebody dragging a girl into the washroom over here. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, maybe if we watch these monitors for a minute. What the hell? Hey, that's the guy I saw taking money from TK. Oh, no, not him. He's part of Cure. He's part of Cure? I thought you said you were being set up. Frank, that guy was a new recruit. I never saw him before this protest. <sighs> yeah, that's a good one. Of course. TK must have planted this guy in our group to do his dirty work. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm gonna find out what he knows about this. Frank, be careful. It looks like he's gone off the deep end. I've covered wars, you know?
sure hope this still works. Randall, my son, I, I think you should reconsider what... Randy! Father, call me Randy. <laughs> Get on with it! Do you, Randy, take this woman mm -hmm. I do, Father. Don't worry, honey. The other ones didn't mean anything to me. Just remember to say I do. You wanted me to wait until I was married. Well, I'm not waiting anymore. Oh, I knew I wouldn't die, virgin. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Cut to the end, Dad. Cut to the end. If anyone knows of any reason why these two should not be joined in union, speak now, or forever hold your... Oh, my God! Help us! Help us! You... You're trying to ruin the happiest day of our lives? I don't know what TK's up to, but he's the one behind this. TK? Are you sure? He paid that poor sap to do it for her. But that's not possible. Why would he let his own zombie supply loose? Sabotage his own show? I'm sure he's got his reasons. So you say... Wait a minute. Is he the one who fed you that tape? <laughs> don't be ridiculous, Frank. Man, not again. It sounded like it came from outside. Looks like someone might be messing with the casino vaults. I can't tell who it is, though. Then I'd better get out there and find out for myself. Now who's ditching who? I don't know if she's really brave or just really stupid. Watch yourself there, kiddo. I hope I don't have to do everything for you. Touché, Frank. You need me to stick around and stay on top of the story? You do come in handy. Look, they're robbing the damn city. That's why TK started this. For money. We sure got our story now. Our story? Hmm. 
I've got a meeting with my source tonight. I think maybe it's time you met. Oh, yeah? I guess I'm not such a burden anymore. I think this is kind of a special case, Frank. I'll meet you at Benny Jack's in the Americana. Wouldn't miss it. Something. Can I help you? Can I take you someplace safe? Oh no! <laughs> we are not going anywhere, zombie magnet. You need to take care of this. You are going to help me fix my toy. She was so beautiful. <laughs> then she got broken. Zombies broke her, but Susie belongs with Slappy. I was her favorite, too. She's mine! You have to fix her now! But maybe you like it like this, so you can take pictures! You want zombies to break things! Well, let's see how you like it! Rebecca? You in here? Rebecca, Rebecca, please! Help me, please! <laughs> All right, Frankie West. You've been messing things up for me pretty good. Time for a little payback. TK, where the hell is she? You're gonna go get me that money you cost me with your little game, Frank. One million dollars by seven o'clock. How in the hell am I going to do that? It's Fortune City, Frank. The land of riches. Get creative. Bring it to the show nightclub, and we might just let you see your little girlfriend again. Don't you touch her. Oh, too late. See you then, Frankie. But we got a chance to be real patriots here, Earl, and get us some target practice. These so-called survivors. Ha! Ah, bunch of whiners let this thing happen. Letting zombies in, foreigners in, letting socialism in. 
Only way to get this country on track again is clean it right up of all those pansies, floozies, bureaucrats, liberals, and them half-assed conservatives, too. This is a golden opportunity. Damn straight. We's infested in more ways than one. If you ain't with us, you're against us. We gotta clean this country up one city at a time. That's as American as apple pie, that is. You know what we have to do, Earl? It's our duty to eliminate the threat to our country. Clean this place out completely. Start again like the great deluge. Right idea, that. That's right. We do it because we love our country. And because it's so much damn fun. Damn, it feels good to be right. Yeah, God bless America. Let's go hunting, boys. Trespasser, I'm in charge of this here mall. You can't just come waltzing in here. You think I'm just gonna roll over and play dead? Not anymore. You ain't the big man in town. Not no more. Everybody else is dead. I'm the big man now. Whoa, big man, not here to argue. No, think you're better than me. Well, you ain't got the badge, do you? Now you fellas have to listen to me. Y'all can't push me around now. Oh, no, not now. If I say dance, you dance! <laughs> Required. I have rounds to do, and I'm behind! You know there's a zombie outbreak going on. Neither rain, nor sleet, nor hail, nor zombies are going to keep me from my appointed rounds. I swore an oath, sir, and this package requires a signature! Whatever, man, if it makes you feel better. I could use that anyway. Can you hold this for me? <laughs> Have a nice day. on the 
postal service. But you think a little zombie outbreak happens and you can get away with anything? You tamper with the mail, you tamper with America! And I'm not gonna let that happen! I need this, Zombrex. Sorry. This one's a special delivery. But I know you loved it, right? Right? I know you can barely even wait for this comeback tour to start. Oh, I can feel that. I can feel your energy. Hell, I can barely stand keeping myself from you. But we are gonna need a few more things before we can start. And if I don't get them soon, uh-uh-uh-uh. supposed to work under these conditions. I am an artist. <laughs> Despite the technical problems caused by my incompetent crew, the show must go on. No! We're... We're wide. If we move, they'll go off. Maybe just another crazy fan who loves me to death. Ow! Good. I got a job for you, baby. Oh, yeah. I need you to run a few errands for me, kiddo, before we get started. I'm not sure if I can take waiting anymore. I get explosive when I have to wait. I'd get her what she needs, bro. Well, we can't keep my audience waiting! Yeah! Well, you've been a good little assistant, cutie pie. And now, it's finally time for my big comeback show. The performance of a lifetime. <laughs> I'll need some help backstage. Help backstage? You mean we're not done now? Oh, surely you're not suggesting that after all this, I don't give my adoring audience what they want? The comeback tour everyone's waiting for? The big number? I might get a little angry if that happens. No, man, just do it! Look, listen, lady. Oh, shush. Mm -hmm. Now, get backstage and let's put on this show. You can't keep talent like mine waiting. That, uh, thing will give you instructions. Prepare yourself for genius. Best stage manager I ever had, 
kiddo. And you've got a nice little butt on you to boot. Oh, yeah, baby! Oh, you love it! You love me! Rebecca, we got a story to cover. You just gonna lay here all day? It's about time. You'd almost think you liked me being tied up. They were your source. Seriously. I know. I'm sorry. But they had the tape. It spoke for itself. Maybe this will make it up to you. I heard them talking earlier. TK's got another chopper coming in. He's getting out of the city. Now. We need to catch him. Chopper? We can't let that bastard get away. Not without an interview. That helicopter is landing on the roof of the hotel. I'll be there. <sighs> Not without me, Frank. You won't scoop me this time. Rebecca, get down. Hey, whoa! Careful! 
people with the money, fool! We don't got much left. Hey, look, boss! Not possible. Not gonna happen. We're taking off. Now! You're not going anywhere, TK! Get this on tape, Rebecca! <laughs> Alive? He sure is. Don't worry. You'll get your interview. <sighs> this bastard better not be heavy. What's he doing here? Isn't he the host of that show? TK paid some pathetic protester to start this whole thing. Ratings were down on his show. He needed the cash. Bastard. We've got enough to run with the story. Oh, really? Well, I'm still keeping an eye on your friend until the rescue, just to make sure. The story is going to be big, huge. It's award material. Oh, yeah. We are going to be huge. He's out cold? We ought to make sure he stays that way. Don't hit him too hard, Sullivan. Why? Capital punishment was made for a guy like this. We need this guy to tell the world what he did. Don't give the slime ball the easy way out. Fine. We'll do it your way. I'll stand watch first. He's not going anywhere for a while. Great. Listen, I'll be back for the rescue. I'm gonna go see if I can find a high vantage point. Get some pictures of the military rolling in. Adam was your brother, 
I'd hate to meet your sister. How about a little ice cream? Frank? Man, that guy had a short fuse. That kind of cracked me up. Damn it! Roger, you idiot! We need to get on the ball if I'm ever going to get out of this hole and into the spotlight as I deserve. Don't you see? This is finally my chance. I mean, our chance. Go, you imbecile! Get ready for the next trick. And now, the trick that the world will soon know us by. But first, do we have a volunteer? A lovely lady, perhaps? We have a volunteer! It is time for the most dangerous magic trick of all time. Sawing the lady in half! Abracadabra! Damn it! Not again! What the hell? That's not magic! This is easy. I suppose you know how to saw a woman in half, right, big shot? We're professionals, okay? Who asked you to come in here while we were practicing? You just want to tear us down, like the others, don't you? Well, we just so happen to have a very special trick just for you. It's a little disappearing trick. You'd be the perfect volunteer. The ending is to die for!
wanted. To do that. <sighs> Sweethearts. Nice shot, sir. Have at it, boys. I'm 
I'm out! Curtis, give me your weapon! You want some of this? Come get some! Can't believe a worthless zombie did me in. Frank. Hey, Rebecca, we need to get you out of here. Right now. But you ain't gonna bite me. You ain't gonna turn me. I'll never be one of you. Get down! Are you okay? Uh, my leg's a little... That's it. I'll handle the field reporting from now on. What happened to the zombies out there? They went... berserk. There was some sort of gas. As soon as the zombies came in contact with it, they... Changed. Sound like some good shit. I have to try some myself. What you looking at? We need him alive. That's a real shame. What's going on, TK? Where'd you get that gas? I ain't saying nothing. Why pay that cure member to do your dirty work? I don't effin' know. He was just the name they gave me. They? What are you talking about? Somebody had to take the fall. And ain't you cute trying to figure it all out? Big Frankie West. World famous has been. One last try to make it to the limelight. Guess again, Frankie. You already forgot. <laughs> It's not worth it. He's not going anywhere. Frank, I don't want to alarm the women, but standard operating procedure means there'll be another rescue operation in 24 hours. But if that fails again... What? What is it? Firebombing. Just like Vegas. Only way to get rid of them. For good. He knows more. A lot more. There's no way he made that gas. He just doesn't have the resources. The door! It's been breached! I gotta hotwire that panel! Stay here! Barricade the door! That was not an accident. What happened to Sullivan? He's supposed to be keeping this place secure. Or is leaving your post part of standard operating procedure? He's gonna tell me right now. by the door like usual next thing I was coming to looking at you you must have gotten loose somehow uh, I can't believe you got the better of me well I can tell you right now that isn't gonna happen again you gotta get me Zombrex Frankie and you gotta move we 
We ought to toss him out there with his own kind. Let him tear each other to pieces. Looks like you got yourself bit pretty bad there, TK. He's not turning yet. Why? Some people are just more resistant to the infection than others. I'm your story, man. You gotta help me. So, how long has he got, Frank? We won't know until he turns. information to calm down and relax calm down the government is gonna bomb us now he's up there missy the government is simply not gonna kill a bunch of unarmed civilians that would be un-american hey we simply need to go out there and take control go out there are you out of your mind hey, fighting won't get us anywhere we need to stay calm i did not work this hard just to get blasted off this rock i've got to get in touch with my station they'll come get me Hell, they'll come get everyone. This is the story of the century. Don't you get it? There is no way out. TK planned to rob the city. But that doesn't explain the rest of it. We know TK framed Cure and started the outbreak, but there's no way he could access the media with that lie that we're all dead. And he couldn't order a military firebombing. This is bigger than TK. Way bigger. Look, I know we've all been through a lot in the past few days, but don't go making it worse and start making things up. Where'd that gas come from? Let me see your camera. I didn't notice it at the time. Everything was happening so fast. The gas, it looks like it's coming from underground. Okay, that's where I go next. Whoa, buddy. Those tunnels are gonna be crawling with thousands of those gas zombies, or whatever they are. Going down there is just plain suicide. No, suicide is staying right here. We all got choices, boy. Wait, Frank. Ugh. It's too dangerous. The story... It's not about the story anymore, Rebecca. We need to find out the truth. For all of us. Please, Frank. Be careful. For me. The only reason we're keeping you alive is because death is way too easy for you. You want that interview. It's plain and simple. Something in it for you, too, baby. You better get used to this, TK. You better get used to being a fool. By the way, thanks for the meds, sucker. <laughs> Don't mess with the face.
Okay, let's get this bunch done. We're almost to capacity, and we gotta get these damn bees ready for shipping out. Let's get this straggler. <laughs> for shipping. Yeah, things are going just as predicted. Absorption of the compound is at 80% of ideal, and maturation rates are 10 times normal. The harvest is going according to... Hey, could I use your phone? Who the hell are you? You're not supposed to be in here! Venatrans. They orchestrated this whole thing. Venatrans? But they make Zombrex. <sighs> you two just calm down a minute here. This one's been feeding us claptrap since you all got here. Now look, we're all under a lot of stress. Seeing things out of the corners of our eyes. Imaginary stuff. There's nothing imaginary about this. understand why would they I'll tell you why it's been a couple of years since the last outbreak people aren't buying Zombrex like they used to but now zombies are back and even the military can't stop them there are probably lineups at every pharmacy in the country all for Zombrex they're making a killing off this this is worse than Willamette they just wanted to drive up their stock. Unbelievable. We're taking these bastards down. I found this down there, too. I'll call my station. They'll send help. Taking care of the idiot protester and that backstabber TK for me. Releasing that tape wasn't part of the deal. It's much easier not to have to kill them myself. Your little comeback proved to be very useful. Now allow me to show my appreciation. Not on my watch! you some help it's too late for me you you gotta take care of this for all of us thanks for saving my ass Sullivan 
You were a good man. Looks like there's a party going on in Fortune Park. Party, you bitch. You've nearly ruined the harvest, Frank. Do you have any idea how many lives you've destroyed? What? You and Cure are killing all those people? You're harvesting human beings, but I'm destroying lives. Good. Good one. After everything that's happened, you still haven't figured it out, have you, Frank? What kind of reporter are you? I'm a Fina transplant. And Cure's been a very convenient little tool for us. They keep starting outbreaks, haven't you noticed? Eager little activists. You work for Fina trans. So this is all for what? For money? <laughs> You're even more of an idiot than I thought, Frank. This is about saving lives. Saving lives. You created a panic to drive up demand. You're missing the point, Frank. We can't make your precious Zombrex without Queens. A necessary sacrifice for our country. And, uh, TK looting the city. I suppose that was for our country. <gasps> oh, please. He was well paid for giving us access to the cages. His show was going down the tubes anyway. Which was obvious since you were on it. Then he decided to get Cure on TV and rob the city. Make it hard for us to finish the job. So what? He dragged you into this? So why didn't he give you up? You think I'm stupid enough to deal with an asshole like that myself? But enough talk, Frank. I had a feeling you'd show up. So I prepared a little toy for you. There's a price for everything, Frank. And you're about to pay it. Like you're a little out of your league, boy. It's Agent S. I'm ready for extraction. 
Yeah. I just have an old newspaper. That needs to be taken out to the trash. <sighs> Always thought you had a crush on me. <sighs> Too bad I don't dig flat chicks. Channel 6 Action News, this is Frank West. Someone lied to you. There's a bunker full of survivors in Fortune City. I need rescue choppers, and I need them right now, before that firebombing begins. bit more carefully. I sure did. <laughs> what? She's alive? If you hurt her. You ready for some overtime, Frankie? She gonna need some medical supplies to stay alive, Frankie boy. You better get to fetch it. Oh yeah. You gonna put in some work for TK. Special guest appearance, Frankie. Ha!
Ali's participation in this game. The show's not quite over, TK. Mmm, not over? Look like it is for your girl, though. Unless you want to try and play doctor.
sorry to take you by surprise out there. We're supposed to be rounding up survivors. Who are you? What is this? Don't you worry. We're just cleaning up. I hate it when the press misrepresents our work. Why are we stopping? going on out there? You. Like you're a little out of your league, boy. 